Hi, my name is Kaylin Duffy. I'm from Alaska, and this is my admissions video for FITM. My project inspiration was based off of modern elegance and costume design. The white dress has a body-hugging appeal with a flowing plum ruffle and a high neck collar. The material used for the body is a soft, cotton-like material, which is lightweight. And the ruffle, as well as the high neck collar, is flexible and also has a soft, lightweight feel to it. The crimson dress is a light, silky fabric that wraps around the figure, almost like a cocoon. The sheer gray material has a loose flow that's accented by the black lace. My fashion club and I had gone to the thrift store Unique Boutique to check out the latest trends that the local community shared. Several of us had picked out the clothes that would best fit their own style and personality. I also picked out dresses for our prom boutique so that the girls at our school could rent dresses for prom. Many of the dresses we had for rent inspired my two modern designs, like the flow of the pink dress, the high collar of the black dress, and the form-fitting look of the blue dress. This feminine design was geared as a more professional look, with the darker gray vest, the lavender cuffed shirt, and the dark pattern of the plaid pencil skirt. With the fun ombre style of this blue dress and the dark denim jacket, this design has a punkish yet girly feel to it, complete with a thick black waist belt. On the costume side of fashion, the steampunk themed costume has a fitted burgundy corset accented with a silky black ribbon. The bolero and the high-low ruffle skirt have corresponding colors of a harvest gold and a dark wood brown. The skirt does have a high waist made of a smooth material which complements the corset and the high socks. The ruffles and the outside of the bolero are made of the tougher material that contrast with the softer gold fabric. The last design I actually drew up and constructed myself because this was my prom dress for my junior year. I based the design off of the Cheshire Cat as shown with the blue and the gray ruffled stripes which are made up of a glittered tool. The base and the corset are made up of a heavier silk material and the blue ribbons for the tie and the boning accent and complement the whole dress. The whole construction of my dress took forever, but it was fun. The theme of our prom was Alice in Wonderland, so I thought a Cheshire Cat dress would be most befitting and unique. Here are the costumes I got to help construct and manage for our larger school production, Shrek the Musical. The cast was fun to work with, and the whole show turned out amazingly, especially the costumes. This is the cape I made for a different play, Technicolor Rainbows. As a creative individual, I would like to incorporate all types of material into my designs, not just fabrics. I am also a welder, and I believe that as a welder, I would like to be able to put metal into my costumes, like steampunk designs and any other structures that need to be built. Thank you for watching my video. I hope to see you soon in California for the three days of fashion event.